why don't we start out with something easy? The range of this is the subtraction of the highest and the lowest. So we're going to have 9 take away 1. Our range would be 8. So in this case, we have an 8 as our range. Not too hard. The mode most is the number that is repeated the most times. So we have two threes, two eights, and two nines. So in this case, our mode would be three different numbers. We've got a three, an eight, and a nine are, all, are the modes for this particular set of data. Middle number can be found in a couple of different ways. If we start at both ends and take off a high and a low in pairs, here's an, our next pair, the 9 and the 3 go. The high and the low, an 8 and a 3. High and a low, 8 and 4. High and a low. This one doesn't have a pair. So 6 would be our median. That's our middle, middle number. Now the mean is the average, so we're going to have to do a calculation. We're going to need to add up 1 plus 3 plus 3 plus 4 plus four, 5 plus 6 plus 7 plus 8 plus 8 plus 9 plus 9. Whoa! Let's see if we can do this a little bit easier. I think I'm going to look for groups of 10 if I can. We could put our 1 with a 9 and make a 10. We could take our 7 and 3, make 10. How about 6 and 4? That makes another 10. Then we have our 3 and 5, make 8. And we have three 8s then, an, an 8 combination here and eight's there. So three times eight, you could think of as 24. That gets rid of these three. And then we have just a plain old nine left. Now when we add nine and four is 13. I'm gonna carry one. One, two, three, four, five, six. So 63 would be our total. So our, uh, the adding of the data was 63. And then we're going to need to divide by the total number of data pieces. So we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11 numbers. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11 X's. So we're going to have to divide 63 by 11. Let me just drop it here for a minute. How many 11s can we get into 63? Well, you know that when you have multiples of 11, you would have doubled numbers. So 11 times 6 would be 66. Well, that's a little bit high. So 11 goes into 63 five times. 5 times 11 is 55. We will get a remainder on this of 8. So we're, our middle number is 5 and 8 elevenths. So on our number line, it would fit right in here. 5 and 8 elevenths is the mean of this data set.